first noticed my hair loss when I was probably 27. I expected to come in and be scared of the price, be scared of my treatment options. I was given a wide variety of options and told you don't need the most drastic option. We can fix this. I just can't wait to see the halfway point and then, you know, the six month point. I'm been married going on 10 years and she had brought up the hair situation and I just started looking into places and passed the billboard on the interstate. He made me an appointment and I came up here. When I first arrived um, I was nervous and then I met with some of the staff and I talked with Michael and he is amazing. Uh, the consultation was good because it was a lot more than I expected it to be. It was so much more in depth with the uh, the micro camera, you know, actually going in, taking camera shots of the scalp. I didn't expect any of that. He's just a wizard in the world of hair. I was blown away by it. On that very first visit, when I left, I had more hope before I even started the treatment than I had hope that over the course of the last three or four years of noticing it falling out. I wasn't ready for surgery. Um, and I am so very glad that, you know, he found a non-surgical solution. I had bleached my hair and I had dyed it fire engine red. It was gorgeous, but you could see my scalp and it was devastating. It was devastating to the point where if something didn't change, I was going to become so introverted that I would never leave the house. Uh, since we've been doing this treatment, her confidence has boosted tremendously. I get to go and look clo closer than she can look, and I can see all of the hair follicles that are coming in. I'll have bad days where I'm just like, oh, it looks terrible, my, I hate my hair. He will look, and he will come, and he will literally grab my head and look at it, and he'll say, if you could see what I see, as close as I see it, you wouldn't feel so bad. I think it's a combination of a few things. Um, borderline diabetic, which help, which causes hair loss. I noticed in pictures, looking at my grandmother, her hair thinned on top, so I think it was also hereditary. And then I did a lot of coloring of my hair, a lot of it. I stopped going places. I would tell them, like, I don't feel good, or, you know, I don't want to, you go by yourself. Now, I I am the one tugging his arm, like, let's go here, let's go there. You know, I want to do this. When I'm sitting under the laser, I feel zero discomfort. Um, it's, it's really peaceful. Each room is set up almost spa-like. I would highly recommend We Grow Hair. Um, from a person who has like extreme loss to somebody who just has a little bit of thinning, there is something here for everyone. I would definitely recommend this, especially this location because of the staff that's here. It's, it's a fun place to come to. It's a very fun place to come to.